come down to Polis to see the Bath of Aphrodite. It's through this gate and it's free to get in. So we'll walk up the path in the, these gardens, quite pretty. You can do a circular walk round here if you like. But we'll go up to Aphrodite's path, I mean bath, <laughs> this way. Right, let's go up this nice path they've done. Up towards Aphrodite's bath. She might be taking a bath, you never know. Ooh. Oh, right, here we are. There's the sign. Right, let's get in the shade, it's a bit hot now. Okay. Right. Here we are in the shade, that's better. Oh look, a nice silver birch tree, I think. Look at the size of that. Growing out the valley. Right, let's carry on. Let's carry on down the path. It's very nice, nice and quiet at the moment. This bit's the best bit where it's in shade. Mm. I can smell the fig trees. Some carob sticks. Let's have a look up. Hmm. Can't see a carob tree. Must be though. Must be around. I can hear the waters. Hmm. Looks good. Watch your step. I mean down. Let's hope Aphrodite is having her bath, eh? Non portable water. There you are. So don't try and put it in your pocket. Non potable, not portable. There you are. Non potable water. It means you can't drink it. Oh, it's making some. Funny gurgling noises. It's probably Aphrodite's tummy. Right, so here it is. There we go. Underneath a massive fig tree. Look. All climbing around the sides of the bath couple wood pigeons up there and there's Aphrodite's bath there and there you can imagine there she is standing there having a shower later on in our adventure we'll be going to Aphrodite's rock where she was born and we'll be swimming around the rock for eternal youth I've done it a few times and it's not worked up to now we've got a mini amphitheatre lot where you can have a rest or a picnic there's a table in the middle here we are. And great views of Polis. Here we are. It's 
So you can take a Jeep Safari up here if you like, if your bum can tolerate it. That's my Jeep going up there now. Well, that's a, worth a visit if you're down here, guys. Remember, no fancy flip-flops or sandals. Yep. Look, another carob tree. There's some growing here. Let's have a look at one. Oh, there's one there. Can you see it? There we go. Let's just grab it. Just a small one. There you are. So I've got the carob stick here. Should we have a taste? Not very nice. Right, let's have a look what bus we can get here. Oh, it's the 622. And the other one's been scrubbed off. Let's have a look if there's any other details. There we are, the Paphos City bus routes. Just near Aphrodite's Baths. It's a nice little restaurant. You can take a coffee, cold drink, and it's set just besides the sea. I'm just going to take you down to the sea now, down the, down the steps or ramp. Oh, oh there you go. There we go, and I'll show you the clear waters. Well, how about that? Let's take you around here. Look at that. There, that's beautiful. Right, we're down to the harbour. This area is called Latchi. And there's loads of boat trips you can take to the Blue Lagoon. Out there somewhere. So let's have a walk around, shall we, and have a look around. See the big boats. Some sailing boats there. Some more boat trips there, look. Hello. So, the Blue Lagoon. Watch your step on this boardwalk. Loads of places to eat. Look. Boat hire. Can hire these boats. There you go, people offering you boat trips. There's the marine police over there. If you're a bit naughty on the boat. Come and arrest you and feed you to the sharks. For the harbour and some beautiful sailing yachts. Cruise boats. There you are. More restaurants, very delightful. There's another self drive little cruise boat there you can rent. It says on it three hours for 210 euros. There you go, there you go, and that one's three hours for 280 euros. So if you fancy yourself driving one of those, looking like some sort of drug dealer or baron, off you go. Hello little pot pot. Has anyone got any food? Hello. 
if you've got any food, um, looking for some food, preferably fish. Oh, that's a nice little scratch. Ooh. Ooh. Right. Okay, so one roll back from the boardwalk and the restaurants are your gift shops where you can buy your fancy sandals and flip flops. Right, on the way back from Lachi is this fantastic ice cream parlour and you buy it by the weight. I'm just going to have a little scoopful because we've been very naughty lately. Loads of different flavours. Okay. <laughs> okay, so Sue's having a small scoop of honeycomb. More? A little bit more? Okay. That's it. Lovely. That's it. Yep. And one small banana off. Banana off. Banana off. Oh, Banoffee. There is Banoffee. I'll get it right eventually. Banoffee. Look, there's rolls, strawberries. There's a broken van just driving past. Orange. Uh, enough, thank you. Aphrodite's Rock and there's a gift shop come cafe ice cream here and we're going to walk down the steps towards the beach okay Go down there and these steps go to a tunnel which goes underneath the road and to the beach you can scan this on your phone and get the information about the place. You see? There you go. Look, see? Ideal. Got this sort of terrain. There's the long tunnel, see? Very narrow. Enough for one or two slim people. Let's go through. We're going under the road now. There we are. And the waters here are very refreshing. Right, here we are. Aphrodite's birthplace. There we are. Now we're not sure which one we're supposed to swim round. I have swam round that one before. Now which one do you fancy doing, Sue? The little one? Okay, we're going to do the little one because it looks a little rough today and the tide's in. Look, lots of pebbles. Oh, nearly. Wear appropriate shoes. Rock, we're going to swim round for eternal youth. Give it another go, eh? Worth a bash. You never know. Come out 30 years younger. made it back to the car park area and there's some changing rooms and with a 50 cents you can have a shower look 
We'll give that a go in a minute. And there's changing rooms. I've just stopped here to show you Aphrodite's rock. It's a bit windy, so I'm going to shout. And I want to introduce you to our new member of the crew, Nino, who's our drone pilot. And we'll be seeing some footage from him in, in a while. Well, thanks for joining us guys on that amazing adventure and a special thank you for Nino our new drone pilot check out his Instagram it's just there on the screen great and don't forget to like and subscribe and if there's anything you like me to visit anywhere you like me to go just put it in the comments below